Welcome to Hi Miss Family Favorites. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make homemade lasagna. Okay, so for our lasagna, we are going to use the tomato sauce recipe that we made earlier. And to that, we are going to add a mixture of hamburger and pork. This is one pound of hamburger with a half a pound of pork sausage. But first we're gonna drain all of this grease off. And I find the easiest way to do that is just to tip it to the side and spoon it out. And I like to just use a heat proof cup to dispose of the grease. I just let it harden and then toss it in the garbage. Oops. Now I'm going to add our meat to our tomato sauce. All right, our tomato sauce is done and our meat is brown. So we're gonna go ahead and just add our meat to our sauce. And we'll mix that together. cheese mixture for our lasagna. You want three cups of cheese total. I used one cup of ricotta to two cups of cottage cheese. You could use any combination of that that you like. I like to have my cheese a little um, less dry, which is why I like to use this combination. And then to this, I'm gonna add two scrambled eggs. This will act as a binder while this cooks. Now that we've gotten all of our ingredients together, we are ready to assemble our lasagna. I love to use these aluminum pans. Um, I feel like they make great cleanup, make cleanup easy. And I can also throw them in the freezer. Uh, sometimes when I make lasagna, I make a double batch and I make one for us to have tonight and one to throw in the freezer. So I get two meals for the effort of one. So to make our lasagna, to assemble our lasagna, we're just going to put down some sauce in the bottom of the pan. This will help keep the bottom moist and keep our noodles from sticking to the bottom. And then for the noodles, I love to use these Barilla Oven Ready Lasagna Noodles. Um, you could also use the boil ahead method where you buy the traditional lasagna noodles and you have to boil those, cook them like you would spaghetti. Or um, you can make fresh pasta and you can look at our fresh pasta video. I find this to be the most convenient, but I'm just going to lay down three lasagna noodles on top of that sauce. Next we're going to put our cheese mixture, we'll spoon that on there. Like I need a bigger spoon. Grab one. We'll spread that out. And you do want to make sure that you get the noodles completely covered with your cheese and your sauce. Otherwise, you're going to get dry, um, dry noodles. Nobody wants that. scoop for good measure. Can you ever have too much cheese? Next we're going to top this with some mozzarella. Again for ease, I'm just using Costco's shredded mozzarella mix. In the busy life of mom, whatever shortcuts you can find are often worth gold. Next, we're going to add another layer of sauce. And then we'll repeat 
repeat the whole thing again. Then I'm going to top this with some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. Alright, now we're going to bake this in a 350 degree oven for 45 to 60 minutes. Wait. For more delicious recipes, check out our website at HymusFamilyFavorites.com or subscribe to our YouTube channel and never miss another recipe.